Heavily armed security teams searched villages from house to house in northeast France after two men resembling the terror suspects robbed a nearby gas station. Authorities are concerned that fugitive brothers Saeed and Sharif Koashi will attack again. They are accused of massacring 12 people at the Paris offices of Charlie Hebdo, a satirical newspaper that often poked fun at Islam and other religions. A third suspect, an 18-year-old, surrendered to police. Witnesses say the gunmen claimed allegiance to al-Qaeda in Yemen during the attack. They probably, the individual probably received training. And we saw that yesterday in the military style, the commando style attack, very sophisticated. It was a day of national mourning across France. At noon, a moment of silence was observed outside Notre Dame Cathedral and throughout Paris. Near the shooting scene, people are placing flowers and wine at a makeshift memorial. Many are still stunned. Taking the metro, waking up this morning, it's been totally silent. The most noise I've heard today has been from the bells. In the evening, the lights at the Eiffel Tower were turned off for five minutes in tribute to the victims. Alfonso Van Marsh, CBS News.